If elected as the councillor for the Okaku constituency, Jacob promises to assume efforts aimed at fighting poverty, underdevelopment and unemployment among the youth. Jacob said he will ensure that people have access to clean drinking water and set up projects that will empower young people to work for themselves and get them off the streets. There is no proper planning in Okaku and I'm ready with my party to bring proper development here. I have expertise in water management and I'm ready to work hand in hand with headmen and traditional leaders to channel water to those who do not have access to water and to prevent flood in the constituency. He will also establish an exhibition center at Okaku where subsistence farmers and young entrepreneurs can market their products and services for income generation. If elected, Jacob promised the residents to facilitate national documents for orphans and vulnerable children who do not have in Okaku to enable them to go to school and benefit from government social grants. IPC's National General Secretary Christine Okamas said her party has a duty to bring about positive changes in the country and better the lives of its people and the right person for the job is Jacob. The IPC is the only party that has given an opportunity for every Namibian to participate in political activity. We don't look at where you were during the liberation struggle. And we are very grateful that we got political independence. That is a fact we cannot deny. However, we have a lot of trouble. We have a lot of challenges in our country. Last week you saw on the media how 2,000 young people were scrambling for 18 jobs. In a country with that many resources, in a country with so many opportunities, but our leaders are not putting in enough effort to address these challenges.